Okay, so at the end of day, day 11 it is now. Um, so this morning we woke up next to the Rombuck Monastery, um, biked up to Everest Base Camp. Now, currently there isn't much of a tent city out there because there's not many expeditions going on, but you could climb a little moraine and we had some pretty good views of, of Everest. So, uh, so Ange, if you're watching this, I got my little teddy bear out and took a picture and uh, sat it on a rock, but the other two were chucking stones at it for most of the time, which caused some amusement uh, in the crowd behind us. Anyway, we sat there for, for quite a while, just taking in the view, really. Uh, absolutely spectacular, as you can imagine. Um, about lunchtime, we sort of turned round and headed back, um, popped in for a bite to eat uh, at a little tent, uh, what do they call it, a little tent city that's sort of grown up a few k away from uh, from base camp, which is essentially just a, a load of uh, hostels, if you like, but uh, with tents, so... We're a little bit disappointed to order some uh, fried potatoes and then hear the sound of uh, potatoes being chopped, so it took quite a while. Um, then we got back down to the tents, packed up and uh, headed on our way. And We were intending to try and get up and over a pass um, and get down to Tingri today, um, but it turns out that this is only a trekking trail, so the road's pretty, uh, pretty rubbish. Um, and really, it's far too far to go in an afternoon, so... We've, uh, we've biked till pretty much as late as we can leave it. It's about 8 o'clock now. We've just set up the tent. We're all absolutely raz ravenous. Um, the only plus point is we have gone up and over the pass. Um, we passed a couple of the supported groups who'd camped a bit lower in the valley, but we were keen to get the hard work done before tomorrow, so we've got a nice easy day uh, rolling down into Tingri. Um, okay, see you tomorrow then.